before we get started, I need y'all to hit that like button and that sub button right now. But anyways, what's good, YouTube? You already know what it is, man. It's your boy, A Ball VJ. <clears throat> and just like the title, this is the ultimate rush move sets. Now, you're going to want to put on every move you see here. Now, the reason why Power Rush isn't on here is because one, it's a DLC, maybe everyone doesn't have the DLC, and two, it's 10 bars a key. But if you have both the DLC and 10 bars of key on your character, then go on ahead and put it on. Now I'm going to show you all these moves in a second. Burst Rush, Justice Rush, Android Rush, and which one was the last one? Oh yeah, Sonic Rush. Along with Victory Rush and Darkness Rush. Now, when it comes to your Awoken skill, it all depends on your personal preference. Because Super Saiyan and Boost your attack power immensely problem is you don't recover as much stamina back potential unleash you can um, get your key back fast um, the stamina doesn't recover as fast but it makes you more powerful uh, golden form you know you take that's pretty much for key blast attacks but yeah if you're a saiyan I recommend putting on future Super Saiyan. If you're any other character, then just put on potential unleashed. Now, when it comes to your QQ Bang, it doesn't really matter. As long as you got something that can boost your strike supers, that's fine. Because uh, mainly when you're using this move set, you're going to want to have strike supers. There's no point in putting it on if you're not a strike super type of character. And your Super Soul is really personal preference. I had beating up gets me cranky. That Super Soul pretty much gives you auto key recovery. Now, I'm going to demonstrate these moves right here. Now, this move right here is uh, Justice Rush. You can use this to follow up a combo. Let's say you're at the tail end of your combo. You're going to use that move and do it at least a half a bar damage. As you see there, 4,900. Now this is Android Rush. The reason why this move right here is so good is because you can knock your opponent whatever direction you want. Upward, forward, or down. All you gotta do is point your left stick to whatever direction you want to have your opponent land. Now right here I'm going to demonstrate Burst Rush which is one of the best counters in the game. Because this is a counter attack which you cannot afford. You cannot afford to take the damage right here, especially if you're going against a character that's even stronger than what you see here. Because this can do up to a little bit over half of our health. So, yeah, that's right. Bar and healthy in the wrong hands. <laughs> so yeah, first rush, if you can land that move, your opponent is forced to use this evasive or they're going to take a massive amount of damage. And right here, Sonic Rush, which it's best to be used after you break the stamina and then you can follow it up with victory rush right here and that's an insane amount of damage as you can see here at any point in a fight where you can hit a stamina break the game is pretty much over so all you pretty much gotta do is two moves and then follow up with victory rush and there's nothing your opponent can do <laughs> so yeah man make sure you guys try that out or if you have another way to follow up with a combo, let me know. Then we have Darkness Rush, which is very popular because if you can get your opponent in that animation, they're stuck. They can't evade it. There's nothing they can do. Once they're in it, they're in it. So, yeah, one more time, I'm just going to go through it all so you can uh, more in-depth for you guys if you're at this point of the video. So yeah, this is the ultimate rush move set. So put everything you see here on. And another thing too, if you're at this point in the video as well, please join the live streams. It's always lit. If you have PlayStation or Xbox, just join the live stream. It doesn't matter. It's always lit. It's always fun. Just trying to have a good time. Just try not to be, you know, too cheesy or toxic. But yeah, but it didn't that, just come through. But yeah, man, like I said earlier, you can put Power Rush in here. The problem with that is that it's just 10 bars of key. But if you can't land that in the match, the game is over. No creative character in this game can survive Power Rush. So yeah, if you were able to hit that. 
But like I said earlier, Super Saiyan will make you stronger. Super Saiyan Blue will make you even more stronger. And Evolve is crazy because it makes you even more stronger than that. The problem with using uh, Super Saiyan Blue is that it gradually depletes your key. So I would recommend you either use Super Saiyan or Future Super Saiyan. Or if you're not even a Saiyan, then just put on Potential Unleashed. Just as good. And your QQ Bang doesn't matter as long as it just has something for Strike Supers. That's the best to do for that. And your Super Soul is your personal preference. You can use that or you can use what I have on the screen. Getting beat up makes me cranky. So yeah, make sure you put that on right here. And I'm just going to show you guys one more time. Now, you see the damage here? This character isn't maxed out on Strike Super, so if you have your Strike Supers maxed out, you will do even more damage. So yeah. Also, I'm in Future Super Saiyan, which is not the strongest Super Saiyan form. Like if I was in Super Saiyan, I probably would be doing 1 to 2k more damage than what I'm already doing right here. So yeah, man, that's, that's pretty much it right there. Um, I'm trying to come out with a lot more of these type of videos all week. Um, I've been trying to stream other games as well out of the Xenoverse. So yeah, I would love to support. And if this is a video that doesn't really interest you and you're at this point in the video, appreciate you for coming through, showing some support. But if you can't watch every video or join every stream, I would appreciate if you just come through, hit the like button, and then you can just go on about your business. But appreciate you guys for that. Thank you for all the support. We're uh, at this um, point in the video. We're at halfway to 11K subs. We have... 10,600 and something. So yeah, appreciate everybody for that and all your support. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you comment, subscribe, hit that like button, hit the notification bell so you always stay notified when I stream or make videos. And also follow me on Twitch at AballVJ. Link is in the description. I am AballVJ. Appreciate you guys for coming through. Peace.